The U.S. and China have ambitious plans for space exploration in the future. In order to do that, both will need to lean on international support. And right now, the U.S. has taken a lead. The two adversaries are getting as many nations on board with their plans as they can. The American-led effort, known as NASA's Artemis, aims to send astronauts back to the moon by 2026, with an ultimate goal of building a lunar space station and launching missions to Mars and beyond. While China plans to build an international lunar research station with phase one completed by 2035. The U.S. is currently notching more wins, with Chile, the Dominican Republic, Estonia, and Cyprus recently joining its coalition, which now totals 47 nations. Beijing counts a little more than a dozen nations as its members, with Senegal the latest to join in September. Many countries remain up for grabs. NASA's Deputy Administrator Pam Melroy says despite setbacks with the Artemis program, like being over budget, the diplomatic efforts will continue. The agency reportedly sees diplomacy and international cooperation as the key to the future of space exploration. For more on this story, download the Straight Arrow News app or visit san.com. For Straight Arrow News, I'm Jack Almer.